The monorail can mean only one thing. A Disneyland. A little bit fuming. Back at Orton Towers to have a look at all of the new stuff at the park, upgrades, new additions, and of course, Phalanx Frogs. An amphibian with authority. Does spit. Ollie, get out of my shop, boy. Don't make me violence you. <laughs> <laughs> to oblivion and beyond. Yo, I've just stolen a phalanx cap from a child and I look cool. Moving on, soldier. George, what should people do if they enjoy this video? Like, comment and subscribe. Tell the camera. Like, comment and subscribe to Sam Costello. <laughs> what a legend. New ride, who this? <laughs> Not much new to report on for the Smiler, but it has had a bit of a jet wash and it's looking very clean and ready for the season. Oh, brilliant. Oh, and the other one. Whoa. Now we need to get on Oblivion before I have a tantrum. We, re we need to go on Oblivion immediately. <laughs> yeah. Last season, I came here for curse opening. I wanted to go on Oblivion all day. Finally convinced the group at about 5 p.m. to go on it. It closed, it broke down. Then I came for Subterra. And they had a long queue. And everyone else had already been on it, so we didn't go on it. And then later on, I come to go on it. It shut down. And then at Fireworks, we just never went on it. And it got to the end of the day, and we queued for Wicker Man, and we ended up being in a Wicker Man queue for two hours. And guess what? No Oblivion. Blackpool was bad for rides. I didn't get on Oblivion there either. <laughs> painted the outside of the hole orange but the tunnel itself has been painted black and the mist is back working interestingly enough next to the entrance to oblivion where we used to have spin jam and twistertron formerly enterprise this has all been sectioned off it's speculation time could this mean that this site is a future area for a new permanent flat ride i hope so Leave in the comments below what you'd like to go here because I really think that a flat ride would bring this whole area together and add a bit more capacity to quite a popular area of the park. A lot of space as well, isn't it? And let's get on a blooming ride now. I've had enough of you lot vlogging and holding us up. All in the queue line, it's all back and working. Here's a bird's eye view of that plot of land from the Oblivion queue. What I would like to see, and this is a bit of a pipe dream, but I'd love to see something like Dance Macabre going to Efteling. An indoor flat ride so it can have show scenes and a thrilling flat ride to almost expand the lore and the storyline of X Sector. However, I'm not quite sure that Alton Towers has the budget to build an indoor flat ride <laughs> of that scale, also with the show scenes to go with it. But we can dream. Come off Oblivion, but I'll tell you about it in a minute. Whoa! I finally got an Oblivion and it was so good. I know it's a one trick pony, but it's one hell of a trick. Not only is Big Bob looking very well this morning with the smoke all working, but we've got new canopies. So that if you're waiting in this queue and it is raining, precipitating like it is right now, you'll be very dry. Hippies everywhere in this place. So we've had some good luck, finally getting on Oblivion. I'm so relieved I never get on that. So let's continue the good omen on the Wicker Man. Oh, it's such a beautiful ride. But right, yeah, let's just get in the queue and get on it. That was a bit disappointing. 
Oh well, time to go on the good old trusty Cursor Alter Manor. Now when this opened last year as the conversion of Jewel, I absolutely fell in love with it. Is it broke or is he just saying we're not allowed in it? Close. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little bit fuming. Fountains are still off on the rap. Well, the rapids are still off. <laughs> Not much life in this Katanga Canyon slash Wickerman side of the park. Water shame. I like it. It gives you a scale for the actual size of the park, but it's also very accurate in showing you where you can go. As a map should. Bass changed. It's had a retrack or something. Small upgrade. <laughs> Nemesis, having that back is so good. I didn't cover this in my Nemesis Reborn update, but this is the new shop and it looks really cool. They could have done a bit more to the facade. However, it is nice to have a dedicated shop to the beast itself, but oh my days, look at that queue. An hour long queue to get in a shop. Nice. I'm going to bypass Nemesis and head on to Galactica because I actually really like the ride. It's really underappreciated in my opinion and I very rarely go on it. You're kidding me. Is it new? Tell me. There's a new sign down there. Right, no, I mean, on a technicality it is a new sign, but no, it's a replacement of an existing sign. Sorry for getting your hopes up. I'm going to go on Galactica and end the vlog there. Thanks so much for watching. Like the video if you did enjoy it. Subscribe. What he said that, man. <laughs> Ciao, legends. No, are you actually joking me? Yeah. Actually livid. You were coming, so close there. Genuinely did. <laughs> okay. Thanks so much for watching, nevertheless. <laughs> like the video if you did enjoy it. Ciao, legends. I've had enough. Yeah, there is literally a train with people on it and people still in the queue. That's outrageous. Why is blood lying to me? Okay, guys, we've got another twist in the tale of the Galactica Chronicles. The sign is now saying reopening. My ending shot. That was good, wasn't it? Please, sir, can we have some more? You don't have to call me, sir. But here's your link. Click it. Sir Punalot would sound cool, though. <laughs>